What's going on, Chill with Dan Squad? It's your boy Ant back with you guys with another video. So, we're back with another Sensei Unchained video Frieza the Monkey Menace. Now, this man, Frieza, hate to break this to y'all, he's one of us now. Like this, like, this man has committed a whole bunch of violations, especially blowing up the planet Vegeta that was destined to rule recently violated the Namekians and most likely don't even get me started on what this man did to Vegeta when he was in his final form but yo this man literally says monkeys and he has a desperate hate for Sa he has hate for Saiyans with passion and the audacity for him to call Saiyans monkeys that's absolutely ridiculous but enough wasting time let's get straight into this video appreciate all the love support and if you're new to the channel you already know what to do run up the likes subscribe all that good stuff and let's get to it now recently we have talked about aizen the gaslight reaper now i'm not going to cap for the most part i've been talking about main characters on this channel but i have to continue the villainry because we got to talk about somebody that is worse in my opinion than aizen because it's okay to gaslight you know what i'm saying okay it's not okay to gaslight but but, but y'all know what i'm saying it's like in anime terms gaslighting is fucked up but genocide is way worse and that's why we're here to talk about somebody that is definitely racist i mean it's not even a, 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 a rumor it's not a myth it, it, it's not speculation there's no, no secret this either fact. this man Frieza is a true racial menace yep. he does not like saying he don't I am not gonna cat bro today we talk about Frieza the monkey hater now before I get into the actual villainry which is Frieza I just want to talk about why Frieza is a true menace now first of all you're probably wondering how is somebody that is four feet tall doing all of this bro there is no way that this man Frieza doesn't get knee extensions i know y'all been seeing the knee bbls going around my man Frieza gonna be first up to get that joint you know how i know that because in the broly movie this man was going to use dragon balls to grow a little bit taller yo oh my god yo that's when you know the dragon balls ain't shit and that literally they're in the story for this plot convenience yeah there's no way that this man was about to just use these powerful items to get taller so he could get on Ooh. roller coasters i am tired of this <sighs> calm down Sin. all right calm down now, back to the villainry so this man frieza based on a myth a rumor a legend decided to commit complete genocide over an entire race of beings now you're probably like yo Sin, what are you talking about and, and that's if you're not really a true avid dragon ball f if like I said, if you're if you haven't watched Dragon Ball and you're not if you're a non Dragon Ball Z fan, please don't even watch it. Don't fan. Now, basically, Frieza heard from one of his reporting it's this. Hello? Is anybody in here? Someone please get me an ice cream sandwich? Lord Frieza, I, I need to talk to you. It's, it's urgent. Nigga, do you have my ice cream sandwich? No. <laughs> The audacity for him to ask for a nice green freaking sandwich. Come on, man. Really? What? Uh, what? Uh, never mind. What is it? Reza, there's a possibility that your reign of tyranny could come to an end. My reign, my reign of tyranny come to an end? Who could possibly do such a thing i am lord frieza well first of all anybody over five feet can do that to you lord frieza are you trying to be funny right now do you want me to blow your fucking face off no no frieza stop please i swear to god i i, I i'll get you platform shoes oh, platforms huh? uh, anyways continue frieza there's a possibility that there is a legendary super saiyan legendary super saiyan a, a golden monkey are you telling me that there's a possibility that a monkey could be golden ah that is blasphemy i would never believe that the aryans would turn into such a vile disgusting animal frieza you are really oh yeah and that broly the second broly movie let me tell y'all this right now what this man broly did to frieza getting his ass whipped for a whole hour while goku and vegeta had to like figure out how to beat him That was the most brutal and disrespectful ass whoopings ever. 
You racist. Is the sky blue? Is the ocean wide? We all know this already. So you're telling me that this legendary Super Saiyan could possibly kill me, Frieza? Yes, that's exactly what I'm saying. And just like that, Frieza decided off of a conversation with one of his subordinates in which he didn't even know if it was true or not to kill all oh the Saiyans. Yeah, of course we know Bardock tried to stop Frieza. But that didn't, but that work. didn't work out. <laughs> because this man Frieza literally used this big ass death ball and then destroyed planet Vegeta. Luckily Bardock knew of this bullshit that was going to happen and sent Goku away. Yep. Which, you know, evidently led to Frieza's downfall. But, but that's besides the point. Bardock is really the winner here even though he got folded, but, but, but whatever. This man, Frieza, was a menace in the Namek Saga. Like, I mean, out of- Oh yeah, Frieza in the Namek Saga was, yo, he was going ridiculous. The amount of, of disrespect that this man has done, violating the Namekians. What? I got nothing. I'm a loss for words because this man is truly Definitely a menace of complete pocket. I couldn't believe that he caught as many bodies as he did. By the end of Namek, Frieza would have had like a UAV, a stealth chopper, dogs, maybe a swarm. I mean, this man was basically going to get every score streak in the game. I mean, I know you can only get three, but that, that that's besides the point. So yeah. Frieza pulls up on all of them looking for the Dragon Balls and he is pissed. Ah, Vegeta. If it isn't my favorite McDonald's hairline man, Line of mascots. Where are the dragon balls, you dirty ape? This dude, uh, first and foremost, he's the one that the uh killed the dragon, and that's when the dragon balls turned to stone, first and foremost. Who are you talking to? Like, hey, yo, watch your mouth, cuz. Who am I talking to? I should be talking to your barber. I couldn't believe that your hairline was like this. And then when my subordinates told me to come see you in person, I just had to see if it was true or not. Hey, Vegeta, are you good? Man, I ain't good. Hey, where Nail at? Hey, Nail, oh my God, what the fuck happened to you? Piccolo, the short nigga did it. The short, who, who are you talking about? The one that aids monkeys. Who the hell is that? What are you talking about, monkeys? Man, didn't they? Man, help this man out, man. They don't get punished right now. And where the fuck is Goku at? I don't know where Goku is. He's probably somewhere meditating or eating or something. Uh, Piccolo, they could take my powers. I'm about to get fucked up, God. This man, Frieza, out of pocket. Now, after this, Frieza gets to fight in Vegeta. And for some yep. reason, Vegeta thinks that he can stand a chance against him. I'm not going to lie, Vegeta got folded. I mean, pretty badly. All he was doing was wasting time, dodging blasts. Even Gohan and Krillin tried to help out, and their ass was getting folded too. Yep. This is the only time I'm going to give Vegeta props in the Namek Saga, because he was trying to protect these little dudes, even though he really was on some bullshit. For but real. That's besides the point. And I'm not going to cap. My man Gohan got some licks in too. He, he did. Out. But it wasn't until my man Frieza went to his second form which by oh, the way boy. why don't you just stay in your second form i know that people Facts. have asked this already and i'm pretty sure freezer and plus to be honest with you out of all the forms that frieza had during this namic saga he should have stayed in his second form in my personal opinion because if he had the power if you think about it in the broly movie gathering all the dragon balls just so you could grow a little bit taller you could have just stayed at, your, at least your second form. Like, come on now. Frieza gave it ex like example. I think Frieza doesn't like being in the second form. He wants to be in his final form and, and tall. I, I, whatever, bro. My point is, you literally could just be like King Cold, your dad, Facts. and be tall. You look like a center on the Knicks. Stay in this form. Oh, fucking be pissing me off. This is probably his coolest form to me because he's not a short bitch. But, but anyways, this man impales Krillin with his yeah. horn, bro. Yeah. He puts this man on a horn, bro. Skewer him like he's a shish kebab hey guys we gotta jump this dude there's no way we can beat him one-on-one -on -one. krillin yo did they what's good nigga move wait what you mean oh shit did they get yeah. away oh. mm. no this big motherfucker didn't just put a horn in my stomach oh shit god <laughs> freezer you stupid bitch i swear to god i'm gonna kill you <laughs> kill me <laughs> You know you're on my horn right now, right? Oh my God, he killed Krillin, you, you, uh, you bad 
bitch. And the whole time this man Vegeta is just watching the tyranny unfold, bro. Frieza is destroying everybody. Flicks this man Krillin off his horn <laughs> like he was a piece of trash. Then he right back on Gohan ass, bro. And I'm not gonna lie, Gohan was kind of going crazy, yo. Started raging he was. Out, hitting this man with all types of hits, combos and shit. I'm not gonna let you get away with this, you stupid bitch. <laughs> Now I'm not gonna lie, yo. He did put the beats on Frieza. He like, did. Like, like Frieza was kind of looking a little scuffed up. I ain't gonna. He care. was. But remember, this is only Frieza's second form, bro. Yeah. So, I mean. It wasn't much that could be done. And all he did was power up a little bit and then put his fucking foot on Gohan's head, by the way. Yep. Look at this shit. Bro, Gohan, you all right? No, I'm not all right, God. God damn. No sin. Help me. Yo, I ain't gonna lie, Gohan. I can't even do nothing for you right now, son. I wish I could help you, but this already happened. And Frieza black now and way stronger, so. Yep. Yeah, it really ain't nothing we can do. Damn, God. I'm breaking the fourth wall, but that shit fucked up right there. So Krillin tries to get away from this man freezer and that doesn't work either even his freezer with the solar flare yo so he could dip off tries to blind him and shit turn him into ray charles but none of that works they did all of this shit just for this man freezer to go into his third form which literally is the ugliest form that this man oh has. god bruh all right, so basically Piccolo pulls up, and him and Frieza had this whole conversation. They have a fight, and my man Piccolo got some extra powers or something, so he was kind of putting that pain in. Well, Frieza decides to go to his third form. Ah, if it isn't the green bean, you think you're gonna the stop green me, bean. Piccolo? <laughs> I'm about to beat your ass. I swear to God, you know I'm powered up now, God. Ah, this motherfucking Veggie Tail character thinks he can defeat Lord Frieza. <laughs> ah, don't make me laugh, Piccolo. <sighs> I'm about to show you my true power. And then this he has, bro, because he got this. To be honest with you, this form is like possibly my least favorite. Favorite. Like this dude looks like he's he's fr uh that creature from the movie Alien. If you know, you know. I'm just leaving it like that. This big ass dildo on the back of his head, bro. How you go from this to this, bro? Went from oh here God. to zero. Bro, got For real. Oblong thing on his back of his head looking like a tumor. Look he got big dude. ass shoulder pads. Bro, you should have just skipped no, no, third no, form, no, went no, to the no. final form. I'm not gonna lie, bro. That shit is disgusting. Oh, what God. the fuck? What is that? Bro, I know you have brain cancer. There's no way in the world you don't. With your head looking like that. Bro, look like Mega Mind. Bro, look like Sheen from Jimmy Neutron. Bro, look like the cone heads. Bro, look oh, like my God. Movies. When the parents had their hair stretched out. I mean, bro, 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 this man look like. All yeah, at this point, when Frieza went to his third form against Piccolo, yeah, I already knew from the jump watching this, I already knew it was wraps for him. I'm just saying. But he was strong as hell, bro. And at this point, Goku was really feeling it. He was in that little chamber. You know the jump with the space coming and shit. Yeah, because he he, Goku was healing from his injuries after that whole uh, beatdown when he was suffering, when he was... When his uh, body was uh, transferred from Captain Ginyu of the Ginyu Force, and that's when they uh, he was in there for a long period of time while Fre uh, Frieza was violating Piccolo and the others. Almost ready to get out, but this man Piccolo had to go through pain first. Man, what the hell is that? I told you I was about to kill you, Green Bean. Ha, he think that you're cool because you're green. You're not the hawk. I'm about to beat the shit out of you. You look like a watermelon Laffy Taffy right now. Oh, man, shut God. your ass up. I swear to God, I'm about to beat the shit off this dude. Oh, oh eek, shit. Weave, weave, weave. <laughs> you can't even hit me. You're trash, Namekian. Trash. Hey, you're trash. That's why you drip stupid. You got this dumb ass long ass head and shit looking like Ooh. a motherfucking Funko Pop. I'm really about to beat your ass, I swear to God. Mm. Hey, well, let me get my composure together, you bitch. <laughs> this guy is an idiot. Look how slow you are compared to me, you dumbass. Yo, Piccolo, you gotta do something. He's on your ass right now. Yeah, oh, Piccolo, God. please. You're my real dad. I believe in you. What Red the dad? hell? What are you talking about? Isn't Kakarot your father? Shut up, McDonald's arches. So after Piccolo <laughs> gets completely embarrassed by this man, Freeze, I mean, oh, oh my god. god, look how he's hitting him with the machine gun blast, bro. bro what's the, crazy, the, with the, the crazy the crazy finger 
death beam. I ain't gonna lie, I ain't know Frieza was an alien or Mega Man, bro. He was hitting him with straight heat. I'm not gonna cap. God, damn. had Piccolo looking down bad. I'm not gonna hold you. This man Gohan was trembling, didn't know what to do. He's mad as hell, but it didn't even matter, bro. The nope. only redeeming thing about the Namek arc is that when my man Goku showed up and Krillin had to get packed Bruh. up for this to happen, that Goku went into a Super Saiyan. Oh my form. God. Now, I'm not gonna hold you. My man Goku beat the shit out of Frieza and Super Saiyan. I'm Yo, I kid you not. Like, when I watched this, when Goku had to watch Krillin get get destroyed right in front of him, and when Goku went Super Saiyan, oh yeah, Goku really went to that to that him era, and most likely, you already know it was reps for Frieza at this point. I mean, it was bad, but <laughs> Frieza channeled his inner hatred throughout that entire fight, bro. Yeah. Now, I'm not gonna hold you. I know you probably are wondering why I call Frieza the monkey hater. Now, listen, bro, that is just me spinning pure facts. This is not fabricated or made up. But before we get into that reasoning, I just have to say that I know y'all probably want me to talk about Frieza and other arcs because Frieza is out of pocket. So I promise that if you get this to at least 3,000, nah, 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 scratch that, 5,000 likes, that we'll talk about Frieza and Dragon Ball Super. Super and the Frieza Resurrection F movie because Frieza's out of pocket. But right now, I'm about to show you why Frieza is the monkey hater. Editor, please cue every single time Frieza says monkey. <laughs> Hello, monkeys. Miserable One, monkeys. Two. Nasty monkeys. Three. The whole barrel of monkeys. Four. You know. Monkey see, monkey do. <laughs> monkey, monkey, monkey do. You're nothing but an overgrown monkey. You monkey! A Saiyan can't beat me. A monkey can't beat me. Round and round the monkey goes. Monkey. Lousy no good Saiyan monkey. <laughs> Destroy that squirrely monkey. Well, naturally, I'd expect nothing less from that monkey. He's clearly that monkey's offspring. It's a damn sin. Hey, yo! Seems Goku shared his technique with. Like I said before, y'all, and I'll say it again. This man has has a hate for Saiyans. And the fact that he he is one of us now, they ain't nobody stopping him from saying that. His sons like some twisted monkey virus. Training is meant for the monkey and not for the master. Go ahead, monkeys first. God of monkeys. But even a monkey with godlike powers is still a monkey. On your back gasping for air. Quite undignified for the god of monkeys, don't you think? Oh You're my god. Your luck, god monkey. A tournament of power. You've been quite a fascinating tale, monkey. Don't you, monkey? Yes, monkey. You see, I still need you to be my little work monkey. <laughs> a monkey teaching a monkey with love and adoration. Salutations, monkey. <laughs> There's nothing that I despise more than a monkey. I suppose since you monkeys staring each other. Oh my God, monkeys, so bro! Take it from me, Goku. You've got this! Fight! Win! Dance for us, monkey. I don't need to share the limelight with you either, monkey. I need no other gestures as long as you keep your word to me, monkey. Oh, for the love of God! This man really legit of seeing monkey over and over and over again, bro, because... At this point, there's not there's nothing to say about this man, cause this man is out of pocket. Like amount of, of bullshit that this man has done, absolutely ridiculous. But they, I didn't see nobody stopping him from for him saying monkey and the fact that he's one of us now. Damn sure ridiculous. But that's gonna do it for this video, y'all. I appreciate the time you guys watching this video with me. If you're new to the channel, y'all already know what to do. Run up the likes, run up the view, subscribe, tap the bell every time I post all that good stuff. I love y'all so much for showing love to the channel. Show some love to the second one called Daily Ant. I'll leave it down in the description box below. Appreciate the time. Thanks for chilling with me. Catch y'all later. Peace.